Guys, it's me, Zavi, again, your local life and business coach. Um, I'm here for Keeping It Real Tuesday, here to keep it real with you guys, like I always do. Okay? So this morning, I kind of briefed you on what um, Closed Mouths Don't Get Fed was going to be about today, right? Um, so I want to give you another backstory. Um, I think I, I forgot when I posted this. I know I posted that I was going to be talking about Closed Mouths Don't Get Fed. Um, I think it was Thursday or Friday. I'm not sure. But on Sunday, I posted that I got a response on my new residence, and that was from me opening my mouth. Okay, all right. So what happened was, and it's funny because um, the creator always does this to me. He has me go through what I need to go through so I can better um, help my brothers and sisters who may be going through the same thing or getting ready to go through the same thing. It's, it's funny. Um, but this is what happened. Okay, so you know, um, I'm getting ready to move. I'm moving this month, right? Well, well, my mom is moving this month, right? And so that means I am too. We were going our own ways. I've been staying with her for a few months, right? And so, um, my my plan is to, my plan was to, um, move to an apartment and stay in the apartment long enough so that I will build myself up to be able to um, get my dream home. Right. And everything else that comes with that. Yeah. All right. So that was the plan. OK. But since me and my mom um, been talking about moving, it's been like it, it just was it was the kids. OK. School getting ready to start. You will be transferring them again. Or if you're not going to transfer them, you're going to be kicking out extra money to get them somewhere or trying to figure out a babysitting thing because you've moved. Right. And so that that almost had me in an anxiety state. And I was like, you know what, God, you know what you're doing. So I'm going to get that to you. I'm not going to worry about it. Yeah, school coming up. Yep, we getting ready to move. Mm -hmm. I should be flustered, but I'm not going to be right. So I left it alone, gave it to him. Fast forward, um, this weekend. Okay, so I go to my mom. I'm like, Mom, what do you think about me asking a, um a landlord if she'll be willing to um sign the lease over to me? Um, cause somebody's getting ready to move out of one of her units, right? One of her houses. And I was like, um, what if I asked her if I will be able to move in there? And she was like, I mean, it it don't hurt to ask. Like, I mean, what? She don't want her, um, the property vacant anyway, right? And I'm like, I mean, no, no realtor wants that. And so I'm like, okay, all right, cool. She's like, just ask her. I'm like, man, what if this lady say no? What if the lady say no? All she gonna do is say no, Zavi. So I'm like, all right. So I get the text and I tell it's Sunday. So I get the text in her and then I send her an email to back it up. And then I go sit down and the spirit like claim it. So I'm like, okay, I get the kids together, my mama together, and we said a prayer over it, and I claimed it. Five to seven minutes later, that lady sent me a text back and was like, sure, sure you can have the house. Absolutely. And guess what else she did? She dropped the rent down, $25. It's only $25, right? But $25 adds up. You feel me? So I was like, oh, my goodness. I'm talking about I'm overjoyed, I'm overjoyed, I'm overjoyed, right? And the spirit said to me, he said, you had so much faith, but you did not open your mouth to do the work behind it. And I was like, you right. And he said, did you get it? I said, I got it. And from now on, I know for sure that a closed mouth won't get fed. No matter how much faith you got. No, no matter how much you're thinking about it. No, how, no matter how much you think the other person knows what you need. Like a closed mouth is not going to get fed. Now, sometimes you may get lucky and run across a person like me. See, I'm the type of person that I can see that you need something, so I'll ask you about it. I'll, or I'll be like, I see you need it, and I just do it. But you have a lot of people out here that are not like that, so and they need prompting because people feel that you need them, but they don't sometimes know what to do with that feeling, or they don't know who it is about. So they need the other person to be like, yeah, X, Y, and Z, and then they make a mental connection and be like, oh, so that's why, so let me help you. Sometimes you got to cut it out and be like, I, it's me over here. I need the help. Come help me. You know what I'm saying? And so uh, just to back it up, uh, if I wouldn't have did that, um, I wouldn't be getting ready to move into this house. Okay? Like, it was simple. It was simple for me to open my mouth. Like, I've been, I was thinking about that for weeks. And it was not going to happen until I opened my mouth. Okay? So I want you to... Be a good steward. 
and just and, and just do what you're supposed to be doing out here in, in, in life. You know what I mean? Ask so you can receive. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.